Hello, and thank you for watching another Education Commons video. My name is Chris Klammer, and I'm here to talk about data. We may hear about different types of data, personal data, confidential data, sensitive data, but what is data? A colloquial definition might be computer data, files stored on a computer, a server, or the cloud, but data doesn't have to be digital. Data is any information that's recorded, that can include writing something down or even printing something out. Of course, while performing our daily work, many of us need to handle data about other people. It could be something as simple as someone's name. Let's imagine a scenario. You're on a call with a colleague and you're asking them who to go to for assistance with something. You write down their name in your notebook. Later, you realize you want to save this information on your work device. So you type it up into a text file and save it to your OneDrive. Then. Another colleague asks for that information, and you decide to just send them a copy of that text file. Now, have you done anything wrong? No, almost certainly not, if it's just someone's name. But what if you wrote down their job title next to their name, or their UTOR ID or employee number, or their salary, or their credit card number? We need to consider what data we're recording or creating as we work, and we need to consider what's happening with that data. Are we taking the appropriate precautions for the given data? Are we storing that data in the appropriate locations? And how does the definition of appropriate change depending on the type of data we're handling? We also need to consider the repercussions of improperly handling any data that's entrusted to us or in our possession. Please also consider how you'd like your data to be handled. We would love for anyone interested in expanding their awareness of data best practices to visit our website please find links in this video's description. We do have upcoming workshops on data retention and disposition policies, data governance, and there are many more resources to come. Most importantly, thank you for watching and for caring about what data is.